Good afternoon guys. Good afternoon everybody. Welcome to my YouTube channel. My name is Hasan Zekar. You know me. I've been presenting uh, modern programming languages in my channel. Uh, today uh, I will uh, present you uh, last uh, lesson uh, for Scala, uh, Scala uh, lesson 9. Uh, so uh, it's not going to be a long uh, video recording, uh, of course. Just uh, there have been left uh, uh, three or five, uh, three or four uh, code snippets at, uh, after uh, uh, presenting uh, these code snippets uh, after uh, we run them, uh, we will finish uh, this uh, lesson uh, series and I hope uh, it's gonna be helpful uh, for uh, developing uh, your ability, programming capability and uh, right away uh, let's start uh, our lesson. Okay, uh, just we said uh, lesson 9, uh, our uh, quote uh, 84. Uh, here uh, I'd like to give an example uh, for extractors. Uh, extractors means uh, just uh, we can uh, we can uh, demand uh, one or two characters or uh, some characters uh, within a, a string block. Uh, this is an example uh, for uh, such kind of uh, operation. Uh, here uh, just I define uh, unapply. Uh, extraction method uh, unapply method okay uh, it's a function uh, it's gonna uh, accept a string uh, argument and uh, this is the option uh, option also uh, is gonna accept uh, string and string and uh, here I uh, define uh, a parts uh, well 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 variable and uh, this is a string uh, split and uh, this uh, add uh, sign and uh, how to uh, uh, apply uh, this uh, th th there is the index injection method of course uh, this is optional and uh, this uh, function will accept uh, two uh, arguments uh, one is a uh, string and uh, the other uh, is a string also one uh, stands for user and the other stands uh, for uh, domain and uh, the uh, structure will have user plus and at sign and uh, plus domain and uh, in our main uh, method here okay uh, just uh, I'd like to print uh, three uh, distinct uh, lines apply method this is the uh, paraphrasing apply uh, uh, we recall apply a function okay here and uh, it's gonna have uh, two arguments Zara and gmail.com uh, both are uh, strings as you know and how about the next unapply method uh, here uh, just uh, it's uh, written it's uh, printed all together uh, including <coughs> sorry including this at sign and uh, uh, this is uh, another line uh, to be printed unapply uh, this time uh, Zara and uh, Ali will be uh, printed uh, with a, a space between them and uh, when I run this uh, code snippet, you guys, okay, just uh, uh, at the first uh, print line method uh, recalling, uh, it's uh, printed uh, like this, okay. And uh, how about uh, unapply, unapply method uh, for this one, okay. Uh, so. Uh, there is, uh, there exists also, uh, so that's uh, that's why it's gonna uh, include uh, some and uh, Zara Gmail, and uh, here uh, it's not uh, uh, a correct format. In fact, uh, so uh, as a result of this uh, method, uh, print line method recalling, uh, there will be none, uh, and, and it's not uh, gonna print any proper uh, uh, structure. Okay, how about the next one? Matching with extractors, uh, uh, just uh, we can uh, make some comparisons uh, by uh, with extractors. Uh, for this one, I define a, a Scala, I define a Scala demo uh, eighty-five. Uh, this uh, 
Scala demo uh, object. In fact, everything is object in uh, Scala, as you know. And uh, with argument five and uh, print line x, uh, simply it's gonna uh, print out, uh, print out uh, x, the value of f x. And uh, uh, this is a comparison. X if x matches. Uh, this one okay uh, it's gonna print out this one uh, if uh, there is no uh, a match print line uh, I cannot calculate and uh, I here define apply and uh, unapply okay because uh, we have to uh, indicate this one uh, for the apply function uh, the value of x is divided by uh, is multiplied by 2 okay this is like this and uh, for the unapply method uh, the z argument will be uh, uh, to uh, filter uh, the old uh, odd value uh, even value for that uh, this uh, structure as you remember uh, just uh, filters the uh, even numbers uh, that's a modulo to uh, arithmetic uh, as a result of this one uh, that uh, decides that uh, this uh, z uh, is an even number because uh, there is no remaining uh, as a result of the division and uh, some uh, z divided by 2 uh, else none uh, just uh, when we run this one <coughs> okay this is x value uh, it's going to be 5 so uh, 5 times uh, 2 uh, equals to 10 and uh, if uh, 10, uh, 10 is bigger than uh, 2 times than 5 okay case okay, so bigger than that will be printed out it's uh, already calculated because uh, apply uh, uh, method is uh, uh, encountered uh, is uh, met so uh, unapply method is not invoked uh, so it's not uh, supposed uh, to uh, print i cannot uh, calculate and here uh, file io section I, i'd like to give an example for uh, file input output uh, uh, operations uh, and in order to use uh, these file IO op operations you have to import this uh, module you guys java.io dot underscore and here uh, I uh, create an instance of uh, my uh, printer print writer uh, class okay print writer class and uh, new file uh, will be named as test and txt test and txt test in uh, txt just uh, here there exists such a file test txt okay just uh, and uh, writer method will be recalled hello scala and writer uh, method uh, will uh, recall a close method uh, in order to close uh, the existing file and uh, when i run this one Because uh, it cannot uh, encounter this uh, file, you guys. Uh, just uh, test txt. I will try once again. Again, okay. something wrong with that. Uh, I will look for later about this one okay uh, this is uh, an example uh, reading uh, a line uh, from uh, input from user input from user uh, prompt by using a uh, prompt okay I hear say Zeki and uh, thanks uh, you just type Zeki uh, as you see uh, here uh, console dot read line uh, is uh, assigned uh, as a line here and after that i uh, simply uh, call uh, the contents of line here uh, thanks uh, for just you type there is the explanation uh, here and okay like this and uh, when you enter uh, 
uh, any uh, string uh, by means of keyboard uh, is printed on the uh, line. And uh, this is an example for reading file content. And uh, here uh, there will be an uh, explanation here. Following is the content read. And uh, the structure is like this. Uh, from uh, from file uh, demo txt dot for each parent that means uh, the contents of the all uh, thing uh, that's inside the demo txt file will be printed out if there exists of course okay hello scholar uh, probably uh, I have already uh, written uh, this uh, thing inside it just uh, I will check it hello scholar just as you see when I run this one it uh, simply uh, withdraws uh, this demo txt and uh, uh, it's repeated uh, for each line and uh, it's printed on the screen and uh, this is the end of scholar lessons uh, you guys uh, it's about uh, 10 or uh, e 11 uh, minutes and uh, so far uh, we have uh, uh, discussed you uh, dozens of uh, Scala uh, programs uh, in order to uh, develop uh, Scala uh, capability uh, you can uh, you can follow uh, much more uh, examples much more tutorials uh, that was the pre preliminary uh, course uh, that I've been presented to you uh, thanks uh, for your time and uh, thanks for your watching me please do not uh, forget uh, to my channel and uh, please uh, check uh, my other playlist uh, I, I have uh, some surprises uh, for uh, uh, the uh, uh, new coming uh, subscribers uh, thanks uh, again bye for now